Short Stories for Little Kids A Fox and Some Grapes A fox kept licking its lips as it stood at a cluster of grapes that hung on a tree. It then jumped up to get the grapes but they were beyond its reach. It tried to jump many times with no luck. Finally, getting weary, it went away saying that the grapes were sour. You often hate what you can't have. A Monkey and a Crocodile Every day, a monkey would eat a mango and give two to a crocodile. Of these, one was for the crocodile's wife. The crocodile's wife thought that since the mangoes were tasty, and the monkey ate the mangoes every day, his heart would be tasty too. She asked her husband to invite the monkey home so that she could eat his heart. The crocodile did so reluctantly. On their way, he told the monkey the reason for the invitation. The monkey said that he had left his heart on a mango tree and that if the crocodile would allow him to go back, he would bring it with him. As soon as the crocodile took him ashore, the monkey bade the crocodile goodbye. Quick thinking and intelligence can beat physical strength. The Crow and the Pitcher It was a hot summer day. A crow was looking around for water to quench its thirst. It could not find any water anywhere. It was so hot that all the rivers and lakes and pools had dried up. At last, it spotted a broken earthenware pitcher. The crow flew down and landed on the neck of the pitcher. It peeped into it. The level of water inside the pitcher was low that it could not reach it. Suddenly, an idea flashed across its mind. It picked up some pebbles that were lying nearby and dropped them into the pitcher. Slowly, the water level rose. The crow drank till its thirst was quenched and then flew away. One should use their intelligence when in a difficult situation. The Dog and the Bone A dog walking with a delicious bone that it had found near the river. It chewed the bone for a very long time, and soon this made it quite thirsty. It decided to go to the river to quench its thirst. It took the bone along as it was worried that some other dog might take it away. As it stood near the river, it saw its reflection in the water. It seemed to see another dog with a bone in his mouth. And being greedy by nature, it wanted that bone too. So it barked at the other dog, hoping to scare it and give the bone to him. But alas, the bone that it held in his mouth fell into the river. Don't be greedy. A Fox and a Goat It was a hot day. A fox and a goat were looking for water to quench their thirst. Finally, They came upon a well that had very little water. So they immediately climbed down the well and had their fill. When they quenched their thirst, the goat panicked. How are we going to get out of the well? It asked. Don't worry, replied the fox. Just help me climb out, then I'll pull you out. The goat very innocently did what he was told. But once the fox was out, it did not bother about the goat, and went away quietly. Look before you leave. A Stag and its Antlers A stag was drinking at a pond. It looked at its reflection and remarked, I have such glorious antlers, but my legs are so thin. Just then, the stag heard some hunters rushing towards the pond. It fled in terror. Its slender legs carried it swiftly away from danger. Once inside the thick forest, it thought that it was safe. But antlers, which it valued so much, proved to be its enemy. They got entangled in the branches, and no matter how hard it struggled, 
it could not get free. And very soon, the hunters struck it down and trapped it. Be thankful for what you have.